He You're does not have out. an odor. He smells seriously like he smells like granola and good living. As the celebrity hygiene debate rages on, Yvette Nicole Brown just entered the chat, dishing on her Tropic Thunder co-star Matthew McConaughey, who has been vocal in the past about his decision not to wear deodorant. I love it. I'm happy. The actress recently appeared on SiriusXM's The Jess Cagle Show, and as other stars discuss their bathing habits, Matthew's own routine came back to the forefront of conversation when Yvette opened up about making it her mission to smell the Oscar winner on the set of their 2008 film. Vivica, get off the line now. I remember that Matthew McConaughey said that he did not use deodorant and that he didn't have an odor. So my first thought was, I'm going to get as close as I can to him to see if he's right. The verdict? He You're does not that have out. an odor. He smells Seriously? like... He smells like granola and good living. <laughs> That's wow. all I can say. He has a sweet, sweet scent that is just him, and it's it's not musty or crazy. Like Yvette said, the Dallas Buyers Club star has been open about his decision to forego deodorant. In fact, during a 2005 interview for his People's Sexiest Man Alive cover, the actor was asked what a man should smell like, and his answer was simple. A man. Adding, quote, I haven't worn deodorant in 20 years. No deodorant? Sure. But Yvette says he does shower. Deodorant, I believe he bathes because he smelled delicious. He just didn't have deodorant on. <laughs> uh, those that don't bathe, I don't understand. Of course, this recent focus on hygiene comes after Ashton Kutcher and Mila Kunis made headlines in July for revealing how often they bathe their children during an episode of Dak Shepard's Armchair Expert podcast. If you can see the <laughs> dirt on them, clean them. Yeah. Otherwise, there's no point. When I had children, I also didn't wash them every day. Like I wasn't the mm. parent that bathed my newborns ever. As for Dax and his wife, Kristen Bell, they agreed with their pals during an appearance on The View. I'm a big fan of waiting for the yeah. steak. Okay, Once you catch a whiff, that's, that's biology's way of letting you know you need to clean it up. And all that sparked what I'm calling the big online bathing debate. Jake Gyllenhaal revealed he doesn't shower much, confessing to Vanity Fair that more and more he finds bathing to be, quote, less necessary at times. Dwayne The Rock Johnson confirmed he's on Team Shower and even tweeted his entire hygiene routine. Also on Team Shower, Drew Barrymore, who tossed her opinion into the great bathing debate during a recent chat with E.T. Oh my God, I, I listen, I, I, I've got two girls and the shoes, I've got some odor eaters. You know, <laughs> it can get real. <laughs> do you do they bathe every day? My kids? Yes. Uh, during the week? Yeah, mm -hmm. absolutely. Right. On weekends, I'm a little more lax. <laughs> Again, I'm just looking for balance. For me, I'm like, you were at school all day, bath every night, absolutely. Right. And then right. on the weekends, it's like you were in the salty ocean, like, who cares? You're fine or right. whatever. But I, I guess I'm a five day a weeker with a possible six. With you. Yeah, but five to six days a week. And when it comes to Matthew, back in March, Drew didn't dish on his hygiene habits, but she did recall what it was like starring alongside him in the 1995 flick, Boys on the Side. I'm going to stand by Holly 100%, but I am sworn to uphold the law, and I don't believe I would be any use to her whatsoever if I broke my oath. Now would I? She really loves me. We all knew he was going to be a big star. Yeah. We just knew it. He was too dynamic, and he worked really hard on his character, and he brought these really surprising turns with the character, and he played it really straight. But then he, at night, when he was off duty, he was like, you know, tequila and bongos. <laughs> so I knew that he wasn't playing himself, and that he had created this character, and he was very serious about his work, and he was just dripping with charisma. And I was like, we all were like, yeah, biggest movie star ever, right here. 